The fantasy of lights just around the corner and all that sparkling family fun serves an important organization and that is of course Easter Seals and Pam Kirk is with us today. Morning Pam. Good morning Angie. Thanks for uh, having us back again. Are you excited? Oh we're excited. It's less than a week before uh, opening night for Ritzy's Fantasy of Lights. As you know, it opens on Thanksgiving at 5 o'clock. Uh, we're looking forward to having Santa there. And, of course, he'll be assisted by our 2020 Easter Seals Child Ambassador, Ellie Jane Pinkston, who uh, they will be lighting the uh, Ritzy's Fantasy of Lights logo display to officially open the park. And we cannot wait. Well, Ellie Jane is the cutest little girl ever. And what a personality that she would be worth showing up for. Oh, awesome. yes. Um, she's a great representative of the 5,000 plus uh, individuals who receive services from Easter Seals. And she's been getting services since she was just uh, two or three years old. And at that time, she wasn't walking yet. Now she's seven. And last year, she was actually in the Children's Nutcracker, uh, achieving her dream of dancing. And now uh, her next goal is to be a cheerleader. Um, and she just represents all the dreams and all the hopes of all the people that uh, Easter still serves with the help of the community's support of Ritzy's Fantasy of Light. Well, that's why it is so important. And there's lots more fun this year, too. I mean, of course, it's a completely safe event driving through. But what about the carriage rides, Pam? Yes, the carriage rides will be back for sure. Um, Horseshoe Bend Carriage Company uh, will be our carriage ride provider again this year. And yes, of course, they're open air carriages. Uh, you ride with the group that you come with. Um, so you will be with your own family members. Um, we do ask and the carriage company asks that everybody wear a mask during the carriage ride. And of course, they'll be sanitizing the carriages in between rides. And um, also, they would like everybody to bring their own blankets this year on those chilly nights uh, because of, you know, health and safety precautions. Uh, but yeah, the carriage rides, uh, again this year, they are $30, uh, including admission for up to six people. And we're going to have some uh, bigger, brighter signage uh, on the Heidelbach entrance into the parking lot at Bossy Field to help people find those carriage rides when they arrive at Darwin Park. Pam, do you have to reserve the carriage ride ahead of time? Actually, um, no reservations uh, and no advance tickets for the carriage ride since they are, you know, weather permitting. And so um, it's really a first come, first serve. Um, and they plan to be there pretty much every night uh, that the weather cooperates. So it's a really special and a safe way to uh, to really make the, the trip to Ritzy's Fantasy of Lights um, memorable and, and even more fun. Pam, tell the audience how they can get their tickets. Well, for the drive through uh, event, uh, they can get their tickets in advance this year. First time that we have touchless ticketing available, they can go uh, online and the website is bidpal.net slash ritzies, F-O-L, but they can also just go to our Facebook page and they'll find the link to that. Um, they can go ahead and pay their admission online, and then when they arrive at Garvin Park, uh, we'll have volunteers to uh, check their receipt that get, they'll get on their cell phone, of course, and then they will be all set to go in and uh, enjoy the lights. So, um, of course, people can also get advance tickets at any Ritzy's in Evansville, and they can also still pay with cash at the ticket booth when they get to Garvin Park. Thank you, Pam Kirk. It's always good to see you. Thank you so much. And sure. we, uh, we hope everybody will make their Thanksgiving extra special this year. Um, we know some people are, are having to kind of rearrange their plans a little bit. And this is the perfect way to still make Thanksgiving a very special day for your family. It sure is. Thanks, Pam. And we'll be back with more Lifestyles right after this. Stay with us.